We got some planes. Good. I distract the planes. Very good. Now, those torpedoes should kill him. So, we're going with the bombs here again. Don't need to intervene. It's fine. Engaging enemy. Engaging enemy. Now, this is how I like to play my carriers. Up close and personal. Bam. If you want to know how I play CVs, then you can ask me when I play one, and I can play one, that's fine. But um, CV guy, that's just too much work. And I don't like CV play anymore. I, I mean, hmm, the, the play I like, it's the, 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 the what I just described in the DD a moment ago. Where you have that infinite, people just flying over, not attacking, and just spotting you forever, and you die for that. That's something I really dislike. But you can play a fun one and support a team, maybe. This will work. I mean, the, the captain's really low level, but <laughs> it will work. I don't mind the CV gameplay. I think C CV gameplay is fun. It's just that it's just one, it's way too easy. Two, there's no, no not enough downside of people just sitting on the blue line. And three, the spotting of any stealth ship is so horrendous, and most of stealth ships can't defend themselves, as just seen. So it just feels like cheating. But my rule, of course, uh, I will not go over the DDs. I will, if I see DD, I will not go near them for at least the five minute mark before I start hunting them. I want them to have actually some chance to do things. It's a shame that I have to decide that. I know the enemy will not decide that, but I will. I will. Oh, we can use the bombs instantly. Yeah, no torpedoes first. So where do we go? Uh, I think I want to follow this line. Yeah, let's go there. Let's follow this flank here. That means we have to protect this flank first, because we can't really defend that for long. Counterpart, it's a Saipan. Oh, Saipan is the one that loses planes very easily. I mean, it will do a lot of damage. It has tier 10 planes, but it doesn't have many of them and they don't really respawn. So, if I can force them out, it would be great. Now, am I gonna get snipes? Uh, tier 8, they shouldn't be sniped here. They shouldn't have range. So, there's someone near. Just. Deny him entry and we go to the center. Very unlikely to find this DD over there. I just want to deny this um, DD here entry, that's all. Don't want to harass him for at least five minutes. Now, who is where? This should be. He should be here. He should be over here somewhere. Ah, well. Or, or he's not. Or he's not. Not really the plan, but, you know, can't help he's suddenly there. <laughs> I can't help that. <laughs> so Atlantico is over there. Atlantico is a good target. I mean, he has good anti-air, so he will murder my plane as well, so it's fair. So they're split as well. So, okay, he splits to stored on U190. Let's go find um, the guys on this flank then. Split is trying to get rid of the plane, but the plane is going well. Really good, good, good. Yes. Hey, sword, hello. Now I'm not gonna harass it. DD first five minutes. I'm not gonna harass him. He was just there, okay. I can't help that, but I have to fly somewhere. <laughs> I was actually trying to avoid it. I, I thought it would be here, so it would be um, far enough, so he could uh, he wouldn't be spotted by me. I mean, I'm not flying over A, for example, which is something that I uh, technically should be doing, but no, I don't want to. But we'll not purposely go for them and hunt them down. I could go down and hunt these two down here. I'm not. But a random encounter, I will drop them if they're right underneath me. I'm not going to throw the game for it. But I will not act actively hunt them if I can avoid it. At least not for the first five minutes. Now, come on, that looks good. 12k. And we're going to lose all the planes here, aren't we? Yes, we are. 
So I think I'll back to Fantastic after I oh, oh. and then we just use these. Cause these have to the smoke, right? Cause if we can smoke a Fantastic. These planes are pretty big, man. Wait, these are just bombers. Oh it's Hornet, it's not the Oh yeah, <laughs> it's the wrong ship. I really thought I had the smoke green ship, I don't know. I have the Hornet. With the big ass bombers. Okay. Um go for turbots then. Oh no. I just noticed that. We're talking about the smokes and things, and I was like, oh, I don't, I don't have smokes. You want a dwarf one? Exactly, that's the one I was talking about. Yes, you're right. I just... I, I fucked up. <laughs> I fucked up, and actually I don't mind. This, sh in this ship... This ship is cursed, because it always gets into the matches, and then I don't plan to play it, and I get the 8th match. Yep, also this is gonna hurt a bit. Uh, lots of flak, we live. Approaching targets. Now this is the best if you use it slightly diagonally, because then you hit the most bombs. And I didn't really get to do it. 10k. Not bad. So with this one, uh, I think it actually Citadel's battles just quite well, but torpedoes are better for the cruisers with this one. I need to look it up. Also, RDD is really scared over there. So is Morgahan. Uh, we didn't lose Fantastic, so where are RDDs? Because they're not in caps. Where are they? Fantastic is over here. Why are you... What? I mean, Fantastic is not a stealthy ship, but come on, man. You can get at least near a cap. And uh, Nagato is the target. Yeah, Nagato. That's the one. We might have to start hunting down DDs, because our team is just not doing things at all. <laughs> and I mean at all. Oh, well, he's done. Waste of my run, but I'm going to go for it anyway. I'm here already. Yoink! Didn't kill him, okay. I mean, we did sit on him, so that's good. Uh, let's not go here, no. Oh, there's stored. Hello, stored. I mean, we see the enemy... Oh, wait, there's planes here. Let's disengage. Um. So, we see the enemy DD over there. There's no radar here. Why is this guy not there? Uh, let's fight... Submarines, let's get a fighter on his face. Hmm. Um, I do want a nose in here. There. There's one I want to be. <laughs> now, I believe about here. And I hope he flies away, because I don't want to kill his planes. I mean, I will kill his plane. There he is. Hello. Now, this I don't mind too much, because he can just dive and be unspotted. He can just do that. So I hope Andrea's doing things. There you go, under. Good. And we go for Duke here. And I actually want to go in here, but Andrea's leaving. I need to leave as well. I don't want to leave, though. I'm not going to leave. Screw it. I'm not going to. Screw it, we're going in. I want to kill that submarine, and if I can, I want to do it with my automatic uh, anti-submarine warfare. Another one of those brilliant things. Wargaming gave two CVs the best anti-submarine in the game. Because automatic and always always hits. It even hits always on a... Um, on one of those smoke... Uh, sorry, smoke. Uh, oil slicks. Which is, most people miss that. Or don't even aim for it, and th that, that thing just always hits it. Let's get these in. Okay, he's ping, but also f running away. Good, good. That's a uh, copy paste. Yeah, indeed, indeed. Hmm, okay. We got the wikis here. I mean, these bombs are okay. But I'm used to them not being really good. I was hoping Monarch would go forward here. Would be nice if Monarch would actually go somewhere. I think this guy's dead, right? Yeah, I think he is. We've destroyed an enemy battleship. Now, Synop is reversing. I'm coming back. Our sub is still there. He didn't use his submarine surveillance yet, I believe. I didn't see it, at least. 
if you did, I missed it. So I'm going forward there. I'm going to this island here. Because battleships can't really get me there. And I'm right next to where the submarine could be. So I can support my submarine by being there. And the planes are going. The planes are going. Let's... Let's put the fighter here just to make it harder for this sub to come uh, to the surface. That's all. And if I spot these guys and torpedo them, you know, that's just fine. Other flank seems to do fine. Yeah. And let's recall these. Let's go for bombs here. There's torpedoes in front of me. The fact that the battleship is still behind me. It's <laughs> just weird to me. <laughs> one fighter him. Just want to get this up on a bit more uh, restricted where he goes. Now I'm spotted. That's turbots. It's fine. I have HP. I have armor. I should instantly die for this. But I don't mind taking sometimes for a team. If they get distracted, good. Citadels, thank you. Okay, secondaries are on me. We got some planes, good. I distract the planes, very good. Now, those torpedoes should kill him. So we'll go with the bombs here again. Don't need to intervene, it's fine. Engaging enemy. Engaging enemy. Now, this is how I like to play my carriers. Up close and personal. Bam. Now we need to get this... Actually... Yes, that's my plan. Uh, actually, I do want to go in there. Yeah, we're going in there. I need to kill this guy in the meantime, but that's fine. Oh, there you are. Oh, hello. Now look at my amazing bombs of ominous. Automatic bombers. Engage. There you go. There you go. We're good. We're good. We'll never miss. We'll never miss. You'll see. And there's it. With a flood. And that means he's now either has used his DCP or he's now uh, having an slick, which means that we will have an automatic new bomb in the air any second now. Put it here, there's the oil slick. We won't aim for these, but my automatic ping does, and there he goes. And thereby, there it goes. And boom. Not it. Free hits. No, most people can't even hit those things. Uh, that thing does it automatically. Automatically. Okay, it's not the best angle, but you know, whatever. Whatever, whatever. Yes, fear me. Run away from me. I am the battleship now. But oh, it goes another of my bombs. Okay, slow down this. We dodge these because we're actually control for ship. Aha. Uh -huh. Yes, I planned this. And those are three of his torpedoes. I think they're all of his torpedoes. And, the, and, the, and he still has the oil slick, so the bomb will come again. Because the bombs won't ever stop, because I'm a carrier. So, just waiting for the counter. I think he's dead. I will leave a few torpedoes. It's fine, there comes the bombs. He's dead. I really have nothing to worry about there. Fair and balanced. Yes. Oh, also double kill. <laughs> is is this is this the game you wanted, Che? Is this the game you wanted? <laughs> What's the fierce most planes in them? Kaga? Kaga, yes, 100 percent Kaga. I mean they all have infinite, but you know Kaga has more infinite than the rest. I think I go straight south there, because I think my counterpart's in the corner. I think he's a corner hugger. Very balanced gameplay. I thought so, right? Very balanced. This is why I don't play them too often, because it just feels wrong. And I didn't really go for any of these. I mean, I saw a few, but I didn't really hunt them down or anything. Still four kills. <laughs> Double strike. And, the, and against submarines, these things are hilariously broken. People are too scared to fight submarines, because they're stupid and dumb. But you can easily do it. I think he went the other way. I think else we would have seen him by now, or we would be spotted by ourselves, so... 
Let's go. Um, actually, I'll get my ship in this cap here. Like this, not to go straight line. Let's put it there, straight line. Oh, Saipan! There is, a. Uh, there's people up north. I mean, actually, yes, that's on those guys. Oh, wait, there he is. There he is. We don't have any fighters from left. Don't think Avant can do much against me, though. Don't think so. So let's drop one. Drop it here. I am kind of sad I didn't get to get the cap there. That's the one thing I'm kind of sad about. Is he stationary? No, he is moving. Just really slowly. Our carries are always surprisingly fast, so... One, two, two. Two is fine. <laughs> and his deck armor shouldn't be strong enough against these bombs. We do pen 42. Well, I think we can do that, yeah. And I still keep killing planes because I'm still a carrier. I mean, not insane, but we're doing it. It's fine. Uh, Monarch is going to lose first Atlantico. I need to go for uh, Atlantico here. Sit up and see, actually should do that. Yeah, I'm going for the carrier. Go for the carrier. I reconsidered, really and the carrier is the best player I think we, have, we can do. And I hope my teammates can kill Atlantico. I mean, 6k. You know, 6k. I also fly my next set of planes to him. I was hoping that Erland would actually torpedo that stuff. Uh, wait, uh, I mean, he did send torpedoes out. Maybe. 3k? Yeah, 3k. And the air support, yes, I'm right next to him. I mean, I'm slower than he is, so it takes some time, but yeah. The enemy team has taken wait, how is he still alive? Someone end him, please. They killed another ship. Another one of our ships. Our, our team is dying way too fast, man. <laughs> yeah, I think uh, I think we have too much points on the enemy's team. Unfortunate. Anyway, bombs. Twenty. Th How? What? No. Oh. Okay. Yes. <laughs> this is the game you want? Good. Good. <laughs> there you go, Che. Your game. I didn't even ask for it. Well, you didn't request it. Oh, we got a task done. What's this? What is this? High caliber. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh. I don't even know what this is, but we got this thing. What is this? This is a new thing. The Honorable Service Campaign. Okay. Maybe it's the, 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 the XP boost you get uh, when you get a ship for first time and you have to play so many games. I think that's what it is. Anyways, uh, yeah. <laughs> the results. Uh, there you go. And this is why I don't like to play Carrier. It's just, it's just, just, I mean, it's, it, yeah, we had some fun. We had some fun. And we actually were aggressive in it. But it just, it's just so easy. It's just so easy.